after Jane Moore was evicted from I'm a Celebrity, get me out of here. On Friday, Ruth Langsford expressed her sadness for her co-star on Loose Women. The 62-year-old TV host was the first to be fired after it was discovered that she and Dean McCullough had the fewest public votes to remain. The 64-year-old Ruth traveled to Australia to participate in the spin-off program I'm a Celebrity. Unpacked and coincidentally, the first person sent packing was her colleague. I'm very sad for Jane, because she's always wanted to do the show, she remarked in an interview with host Joel Domit. This would have been the biggest obstacle, and she loves a challenge. However, when she just draws people out, they may see the compassionate side of her. I assume everybody believes they're not getting enough screen time in a reality program. Ruth remarked in response to Jane's apparent jab at Dean McCullough, whom she allegedly labeled flamboyant and who received more airtime. She makes a really good point that there are individuals quietly going about their business and without them, it would collapse. But I'm sure she won't hold it against anyone. After being given the responsibility of cleaning up the camp, Jane became involved in a dispute over ageism and sexism in the jungle. She accused former boxing champion Barry McGuigan and McFly frontman Danny Jones of being sexist and ageist for assigning her the role because she was an older woman. I had three jobs before then, and I worked like a dog, so I wasn't pleased about that, she said to hosts Anton Deck as she was leaving. I put in a lot of work down there. But since I'm the first one out, hard work goes unnoticed. She warned the surviving campmates, saying, I would like to see the quiet hard workers win. There are a lot of showmen in there. The more people get voted off, it will get a parent who isn't doing that much. Since they aren't showy, I want Colleen Rooney or Melvin Odom to win. I have lived it and it's just such a weird and magical experience, she remarked, referring to her time spent in the forest. You wouldn't argue that the rain is the best experience of your life, despite what people often remark. I've never been so immersed in my life at once. I'm never going to wash up again, so at least that's a relief. Asking inquiries and getting to know the other person was enjoyable. All of us have each other's backs. Since I work as a journalist, they were originally thinking, hang on, what's this going to be like? But it was amazing to get to know me. Many of them reported feeling better after talking to me about topics they hadn't spoken in years. Ellie, age 32 and Grace, age 22, who she shares with her ex-husband Gary Farrow, age 22, welcomed Ms. Moore off the I'm a Celebrity Bridge. When McGuigan, 63, attempted to defend the couple's choice in the jungle by stating that Jane, who was 62 and a year younger than him, could prefer something less demanding, Jane shot back, saying, so ageist and sexist. I'm not angry. I'm simply expressing that women are doing the dishes once more, she remarked. Despite her fellow Loose Women panelists voicing their support on the ITV chat show, Ms. Moore persisted in complaining about her duty throughout the week, frustrating the public. The 77-year-old Janet Street Porter stated, I told you earlier, Colleen, that I wasn't entirely happy with the way they edited about Jane and cleaning up. You have no control over what people at home see about you while you're on I'm a Celebrity since everything you say is being filmed in a mess. Moore began the series by skydiving from a helicopter onto Byron Bay on the Gold Coast, saying she was flying the flag for the over 60s before she appeared on the show. However, after being urged to do so by her co-stars on Loose Women, Colleen Nolan and Ruth Langsford, she was only voted for one Bush Ducker trial on Tuesday night. However, Jane's outburst at Barry and Danny last week after they selected her to be the camp's washing up stunned some spectators. Jane yelled, Oh what? After they announced that she and Talisa would be in charge of the camp's operations. Is that a result of our gender? As Jane persisted in her complaints, Dean began chanting, We stand with Jane. As Barry attempted to defuse the situation in the camp. I'm not angry. I'm simply expressing that women are doing the dishes once more, she remarked. Even while Dean immediately defended the TV personality, social media users weren't exactly in agreement. Show viewers criticized the star's actions on X and advised her to get a grip. What's got Jane so triggered? It's not that serious hashtag I'm a celeb, they added, along with drama in the kitchen with Jane washing up. Jane, stop talking and wash the dishes. You mentioned that you've tried various tasks, so what's the matter? 
I hope Jane's dishwasher at home never breaks down. Jane, please get a grip. When Danny asked Jane what she wanted to do instead, she responded, Doesn't matter, done now. Other people criticized the star for acting like a child, reacted as though they were a real child. Jane, get over yourself. At least you're not on Denny duty. Was written by a mother. Really wishing I voted Jane for a trial, going on like a child over a bit of washing up, said another, who explained that they were so horrified that they wished they had voted for Jane to face trial as punishment. Others claimed that Jane was irritating them. Others, however, were more understanding and chastised Danny for failing to foresee Jane's response, writing. To be fair, Danny saw it coming and was going to reconsider the chores based on gender balance, but didn't see it through.